G'day, how's it going? Haven't done this for a little while, the 3 minute build series, it's back. Builds are just something else, uh, everybody asks for them, everybody needs them, it makes sense. Obviously this channel is far from a build channel, but when the opportunity arises and there's a really good comp build on offer from my team, I like to give you guys a proven build. And in this case, we're giving you Ramses. Now Ramsey is a right mid for my team Olympus Elite. He's won almost everything, he is a G. He's a lovely player, he knows how to play the position, and therefore this build helps him to provide that. Before I get into it, I, I just gotta clarify, I guess I can call this build a winger build. I'm also gonna call it a wing back build because that's the position that he plays for us since we run a 3-5-2. So in either one of those roles, she'll be right, mate. Jumping into the skill tree first, it's really important to have your stamina up and also your reactions. Ultimately, Ramsey has both on 89, he's doubled down on reactions, and with all the people complaining about stamina being just ass on this game, it's good to kind of max it out. When it comes to defending, even though he runs that winger slash wing back role, he doesn't have anything. But then again, all the stats are over 60. You have 64 interceptions, 67 defensive awareness, given he's a level 100, but still, you're at a competent level where you can save your skill points, allocate them elsewhere. Again, the build is very attacking, so there's really no need, and if you do need to drop back, well, if you're good enough to defend, you're able to do it anyway. Dribbling time, and yeah, just like much of my team, they like the ball, they like balls. Everybody wants to be fast and agile and quick on and off the ball. You wanna have that flair, you wanna make it look like the ball is glued to your right foot, and as a result, you need to max out dribbling. Even as a goalkeeper, I've allocated a lot of skill points to dribbling. And that's because whatever position you play, especially a winger or wing back, it's important to be lightning quick. And for the first two archetypes, he's gone for Maestro and also Lynx. And also, like I said, you're incredibly agile. I mean, look at those stats. Passing wise, Rams is a hog. He's maxed out his short passing, he's halved his long passing. He's also going for vision, which helps with the passing, of course. And lastly, one on crossing. So overall, you have a really nice mix. And if you use those R1Xs or What's the Xbox equivalent? I think it's RBAs. But yeah, you can do those a lot quicker and your passes are gonna hit the mark. Shooting wise, again like skill points, you wanna max out your weak foot now. Ramsey's also gone for the sniper, which helps you to become a set piece specialist. And a finisher. Because you're operating at a really high position on the pitch, you're essentially half a striker. He's gotten his finishing maxed, he's gotten his shot power increased, and therefore when you green them or even just normal finesse shots or power shots, you're gonna be hitting the target more times than not. <coughs> My throat's gone. Lastly is pace, and just like dribbling, max it all out. You don't want to be sluggish, and by getting that cheater archetype, by getting that sprint speed and acceleration up, you're not. Notice too how many archetypes Ramsey's gotten on his build. Okay, as for the perks, don't worry about the left side, those are just mine. <clears throat> Ramsey's opted to go with number one, the skill dribbler, which helps improve your dribbling and skill moves. It also gives you that flare trait. Number two is active first touch, so your touch is going to be a lot shorter, and therefore you're not going to lose the ball really easily. It helps you to glide past defenders, and if you got this perk on and also you're a really good dribbler, it's only going to show on the pitch. And lastly, whether you're off to the sides running a 3-5-2 or if you're more up front running a 4-3-3 for example, either way, as a winger, you're expected to get up the pitch and finish in the box. And that's why Ramsey's opted to go for the poacher, so you're shooting inside the box, it's going to be a nightmare for the goalkeepers, me included. I mean, look at those stats, he's almost doubling his goals per games, and his assists are pretty, pretty good. In terms of the height and the weight, Ramsey is 5 foot 8 and 99 pounds, which equates to 172 centimeters and 44 kilograms. And that wraps up the build. If there's any other comments or questions you have, please let me know below. The Pro Club's Discord link, it's in the description. Let's get to 1.1k. Hopefully I've helped you out. Thank you for helping me out. Take care, stay safe, 